The race for the next mayor president of East Baton Rouge is picking up steam. As Fox 44's Crystal Whitman reports, there's no shortage of well-known candidates in the race. A number of candidates are looking to unseat East Baton Rouge Mayor President Sharon Weston Broom this fall. They're expressing their views on a number of topics, including the creation of a new city of St. George. Councilman Matt Watson, a Republican, believes it's important to cross the aisle and work with all parties. I'm going to be running as the pre mayor of Baton Rouge, but the president of the parish as a whole. So as president of the parish, I would work not against but with Mayor Dave Amarine, Mayor Dave Barrow, Mayor Waite from Baker, and whomever will become the mayor of St. George to make sure that the parish is a good partner to those cities outside of the area, not just the unincorporated areas, but those other cities. Councilwoman Tara Wicker, a Democrat, says it's the job of the mayor president to represent everyone, no matter where you live. I think it, it, it is necessary for us to look at what are the issues that even cause our neighborhood to be divided, especially as it relates to St. George. I don't know anyone in this parish and in this community that didn't want uh, great education for their children. As a mother of six children, I have one shot to educate my kids really well, and that I'm fanatical about making sure that happens. I don't think any of us have any issues with having the conversation about efficient and effective government. State Representative C. Denise Marcel, also a Democrat, believes setting up the city of St. George prior to the judge's decision was a bit premature. I believe that the people have, yes, gone to the polls and voted. At some point, the court has to determine the next uh, action that happens. When they began to give them their own city, then of course we need to talk about what's fair to all of the Baton Rouge citizens who have to continue to pay taxes on um, things that we bonded, money that we've already bonded. Baton Rouge businessman Jordan Piazza, the youngest candidate in the race, says as an American, he respects a person's right to vote. Well, you know, the St. George issue is peculiar in the fact that it's um, it's one that the mayor, Sharon Western Broom, is personally suing, not the city of Baton Rouge. And I think some people uh, often forget that. But I mean that, I say that because, when I, you know, it's really up to her. You know, reelected or not, she has to decide how she's going to, you know, what she's going to do with that lawsuit. But it's the voters that will have the final say as they head to the polls November the 4th. Crystal Whitman, Fox 44 News.